20-year-old Evangeline Philliams was murdered in her dorm room in cold blood. The murder was thought to have been committed by her brother, Evangelo Philliams, but the jury let him off free word willy-nilly, you hear? Tonight, I'll sit down with Evangelo and uncover the truth behind his cold-blooded cover-up. I'm Leon Barnes and this is Investigatory Report. I sat down with Mr. Philliams to ask him what the deal was with his sister. What's the deal with your sister? Murder. The Popo thought you killed her, but the jury didn't. Why? Lawyer. Would you describe the murder as brutal? Yes. How would you know if you weren't there? Photograph. If you could describe this whole ordeal in one word, what would it be? Sad. Have you ever uttered a complete sentence in your entire life? One involving both a verb and a noun? Probably. So did you murder your sister? No! I had never been more confused in my entire life. Solving this case was going to be harder than stealing candy from a baby. It would be the opposite, like putting candy in a baby's hands, or stealing baby from a candy. Evangelo Philliams, you're under arrest for the murder of Evangeline Philliams. Why? It was just revealed to me that on the day of your sentencing, the jury was practicing an ancient ritual known as Opposite Day. Come on, bitch. I gotta take you to jail. I did it! I solved the case! I then decided to turn my attention to the crappy lawyer, who just let his client get arrested and haul to the big house right in front of his eyes. So why did you just stand there like a baby giraffe who just learned how to stand there while Mr. Philliams was arrested? Objection. On what grounds? On the grounds that there is no party up in this! That was the hardest, most easily difficult novice case I've ever solved in my life. That mystery dough. And to think it all came down to opposite day. Bad day, America. Until last time, I'm not Leon Barnes and this used to be Investigatory Report.